Hello there, beautiful Cancer, and welcome into Sage Sunset Healing Tara. Thank you for being here. I do hope that you are well. I appreciate your likes, shares, and subscribes on this channel. You continuing to like, share, and subscribe is so much appreciated, and I'm very grateful. So, onward we go. Welcome in, and we're looking at this fire sign, and I hear emergency. In the previous reading, I glanced at this king of wands and I got the energy of emergency. That word came to me. So I decided to do a reading separately to look further into this. So either this is sexual energy for real, for real, this person is sexually anxious or upset or jealous or just like frowning about someone they're attracted to and not being able to attract into their vibration something that they want it could be something that this person is trying to manifest something that they're visualizing but there's a bit of t um i hear tendency maybe to the what to be too open to not be committed the maybe to be fearful as well to not trust and to have anxiety this person is also, even though they're noble, they probably have a good heart. Their emotions and their energy, they could use some boundaries. You know what I mean? So maybe this person wouldn't be faithful in a relationship because they don't have boundaries and standards in and out. This one, we would say, has open relationships. That's what they don't have control over their emotions. This one would get sexual addictions and so on and so forth and used this one would also be manipulative especially when it comes to sex and energy and emotions okay so even i just say this person has a good heart maybe lead with their heart it can also mean that they are in tune with a certain aspect of their emotions um maybe that helps them to be kind of a player because they understand emotions too and they know how to tap into the heart um I don't know if this person feels like it seems like this one feels like it's been a long time or it's been a long time that I've got you on my mind. Ooh. Anyway, but all right, so they're upset. They feel burdened. This is what this one is going through. The 10 of wands, they feel burdened like, uh, they are confused. They have a lot working on at the same time, trying to start over, start anew, especially because of this ending. They're confused, especially seeing that you are moving forward. It's like they're going through a lot right now. So you are coming back to mind and they're like, oh, look at how cancer is moving forward. Not even thinking of me or whatever. So they're upset and is thinking of you. I feel constantly. All right. They are thinking about this ending. It's on their mind. Like they're thinking about a lot of different things. Like how did this happen? Why did it happen? What can I do? This person feels like they're also alone um, going through all of this. I feel like therapy could help this one. So yeah, they're sad, broken hearted, disappointed. Maybe they, in, um, they endured a second loss. Maybe the karmic that they ended up with broke their heart as well. And so it is really bringing back to, that's why they're so, they have this kind of jealous energy toward you because they're like, how are you okay? I moved on and things seem to be falling apart, you know, um, and you are, you're, you're moving on fine. You're not even thinking of me. This person could be losing sleep as well, Cancerian, um, losing sleep, losing money, losing time. This person could be dodging in and out, watching you, sending people to watch you. Look at what you're doing. As I'm feeling like you are all they think about at this point. And I feel like they want to copy you. They may want to move toward you. Come back around. They may want to come back around to to this trap you in the mind get you thinking small again perhaps so you feel defeated and they feel more victorious i cannot believe this but 
It just seems like this person does not want you to, to succeed or to prosper. It's like hard for me to imagine that this person maybe want you dead, perhaps, out of here. Um, if that, if they're that upset, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Earth sign. Like they may want to get you in trouble. Ten of Swords, they want to hurt you. Why? Because <laughs> they're toxic as fuck. And maybe they want you to return to the toxicity. They want to control you, blind you, manipulate you. But why Cancer? <laughs> they want the Queen of Cups in their home. For what reason? Oh my god. I feel like you make this person happy. They just feel... This person is possessive. As if they just... Like you're a figurine and they just want you to stay right there. It's the energy of being kidnapped by... Godzilla. And just Godzilla wants you to just stay right on the mantelpiece and you're not supposed to move. He doesn't talk to you. He doesn't communicate. He doesn't treat you well. He just wants to know... That you're in the home, that's all. He's ill-mannered, he's an animal. But he just wants to have this beautiful thing in his home. And not just that. You bring light or love to his, to him. It's like this devil, this troll went out and found himself this fairy and kidnapped her <laughs> it's serious though he feels like you inspire him this devil and help to guide him or find a peace you know like it's having a Mary Magdalene statue somewhere even though this person may not be religious it's just that when they saw you you Gave them some feeling of peace or hope or love. And they want it back. Possibly. Tell me more. You as the Queen of Cups. Your vibration seems unbothered. I mean the High Priestess. You seem to be aware of this all. Even in the midst of it. Even if you were still in his house, on his mantelpiece, you are aware of all of this. I'm not sure if you have hate in your heart or if you, I don't feel like you do, have hate or anxiety or fear. You're more taking in the place too. I'm not sure if you've gotten comfortable possibly with the nine of cups why have you gotten comfortable here as cancer got comfortable wow cancer you there's something that attracts you to this person or attracted you This like me. I think you may find this person attractive as well, even though he's the devil. I'm telling you, or even though he's Godzilla. You, you don't mind. Okay, I don't get it. 
you like being there. I don't know. Like this person inspires you. Maybe you like to watch this person work. Even though he's grumpy and he's a devil or whatever. You know what I mean? It's like a story of some strange romance. I know I'm feeling you're feeling like you, you're realizing you need to get out of here now. And this is when the heat turns on. You know, this is when it gets heated. It's a battle. You two may really be soulmate to the two of cups energy. And so I feel like you really decided to leave. Show me can Am I getting this correct? I feel like it. So you decided to leave. And now that's why this person is upset. Because they're like, you're happy you've left. And like they miss you in the home. You're not there. Everything is falling apart. Their little token of inspiration that was just sitting right there all on the mantelpiece that they could look at. Whenever they look over there, it's gone. It's not there. And they're upset. And they want to throw things and break things like, a monster would really like overact like um overreacting maybe that's the energy there and look at this person's face they're upset he probably wants some it's a lizard lap this person may be trying to fix things but it's not meant to be fixed like they're trying to come up with a potion or a plan because they think it is the right thing to do as if they think they're fixing things with this plan to bring things, to make things right. It's the energy of a villain trying to make things right but you know he's going to screw up because his idea of making it right is not the way to make it right, villain. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm not helping, right, by calling this person a villain. So they have this bright new idea. To do what? To come toward cancer and see Baby, you're all that I want. Maybe they'll ask you to marry them. Maybe that's their plan. But we will see. Is this person planning something big? Like in front of Cancer's family. What? Return to a place where... Something huge. Like they'll just pop up out of the blue all happy saying, you remember the time you said you wanted to go to Blue Mountain Springs or something like that? No, no, no. Mm -mm. You don't love me and I CMOS heals the body by removing harmful chemicals that are caused by some foods we eat, 
hormones, toxic substances, and radiation from 5G from our devices. Heal your temple with the minerals of infinite oceans. CMOS has over 90 of the 102 nutrients our body needs, like copper, which creates balance and harmony. To learn more about CMOS health benefits or to order your first premium grade CMOS, email italkitchenstyle at gmail.com.